Like his father, the Emperor Yuzhong, Qianlong really liked the cosplay. We know in Qing Dynasty, Han Chinese traditional clothes was replaced by Manchurian clothes. So Qianlong had no chance to wear Han Chinese clothes in public, but he could wear them in paintings. From the existing paintings. Qianlong really liked to pretend to be Han Chinese scholars. Qianlong also loved to pierce himself into some famous paintings. For example, Xi Xiang Tu, washing the elephant painting, was created by Ding Yunpeng in Ming Dynasty. Washing the elephant was a hot topic. In ancient Chinese Buddhism artworks, Qianlong believed in Tibetan Buddhism. In Tibetan Buddhism, he was identified as Wen Shu Pusa. So Qianlong asked his court painter Ding Guanpeng, created a washing the elephant painting for him. In this artwork. Wen Su Pusa was pierced to Qianlong's face. Actually, the original washing the elephant was appeared in other artwork, which was made by Lang Shining. Shi Yi Shi Er Tu, Tu is one painting was created in Song Dynasty. In this painting, the artist was drawing the person in the center. But behind him, there was this person's portrait. So one is two, two is one. Qianlong really liked this concept, so he asked the court painter to draw a similar painting. Again, Qianlong became the main character of this painting. Besides. Qianlong liked to see himself in different ages, appeared in the same painting. For example, in Pingan Chen Xin Tu, some people think in this painting there are Yunzheng and Qianlong. But if see the whole painting, especially the three stamps on the top, we can reasonable conclude. That they are the older Qianlong and the younger Qianlong. Thank you for watching this video. See you soon.